is the new Berkeley Power Stinger the best new trailer bait on the market? That's what we're going to find out right now. So if you like this kind of content, make sure you hit that subscribe button. And also, if you're new and subscribing for the first time, leave me a comment so I can say hello and welcome you to the team. If you don't know, most most of the pros who are really big into chatterbaits and vibrating jigs believe you should have some sort of swim bait style as a trailer. It offers more presence in the water, vibration, uh, water dis displacement, and in some cases it makes the bait work properly. New to the market is the Power Stinger from Berkeley. It has the Power Bait scent and has that same texture or plastic that the Berkeley Gilly has. Maybe not as much, but it's meant to be a chatterbait trailer for the slobber knocker. But I believe there's one better than this, but I think we have to put them against each other to find out which one is better, which one looks better. So we're gonna look at this in three ways. We're gonna look at this on a regular slobber knocker, then we're gonna put it up against the Smash Tech Blade Aid on a slobber knocker. We'll put it on a slobber knocker with no trailer because I do think that sometimes it's hard to see the action of the tail as that silicone skirt is fluttering in the water. So we'll look at it both both trailers on a non-skirted slobber knocker and then last but not least we'll put it on a jackhammer and see which one looks better now I filmed these in a pool and I filmed them in 120 frames per second so we could look at them in ultra slow motion and then make the decision for ourselves now this one has scent and the power bait the smash tech blade aid does not so that adds a little bit of enhancement to this one but the action of the bait is what we're looking at. Does it have? Does this really have better action than the Smash Tech? We're gonna find out. Then you're gonna tell me what you think. I'm not gonna give you my opinion. I'm gonna show you what I think they should do and how they work. And then your job is to tell me which one wins in the comments below. This is the Berkeley Power Stinger on a slobber knocker at normal speed. This is the Berkeley Power Stinger on a slobber knocker in slow motion. This is the Blade Aid Smash Tech on a slobber knocker at normal speed. This is the Smash Tech Blade Aid on a slobber knocker in slow motion. This is the Berkeley Power Stinger on a slobber knocker with no trailer in slow motion. This is the Smash Tech Blade Aid on a slobber knocker in slow motion without a trailer. This is the Berkeley Power Stinger on a Z Man Jackhammer in slow motion. This is the Z Man Jackhammer with a Smash Tech Blade Aid as a trailer in slow motion. This is a side-by-side -side comparison in slow motion of the Berkeley Power Stinger and the Smash Tech Blade Aid. There we have it. Which one is the winner? Leave me a comment below on who you think is the winner or which bait is the winner. I'd love to, uh, I'd love to see what you guys think. Okay, there it is. More videos coming soon. You can't even believe it. Lots and lots of videos upcoming. And I appreciate y'all watching. Remember, take a kid fishing, get your fish on. Sorry my voice is hoarse. Swimming. Just how it is. Screaming for the kids. See y'all later. Cheers.